So here we are, here we go, to Cran Stacky. A uh, different way of approaching it from the uh, eastern side instead of the west. It's full of mist at the minute. It's a very muggy day. October, a balmy 16 degrees. <laughs> so, gonna get through this uh, forest and pick up a path and uh, get up onto the top of um, Grand Stacky Ridge. Yeah, coming in from the east to Grand Stacky is not the um, usual way, as I was saying, but I've done it from the other side, on the western side, and I think if you're going to do them again, better to try and approach them from a different different uh, angle, different way, because it's like you're climbing a different mountain, seeing different terrain and views. Uh, I wasn't sure if there were going to be um, a fencing up here, but look at that. Straight up. Very um, misty, but the views are opening up already. Slowly getting nearer. It's a good path, is this? Well, it has an eerie look to it. It's like I'm stepping out into the unknown here. Just hope the pictures come out okay, because it is pretty dark. Bit of an obstacle. So I'm here at the bottom of the Belak now. So I'm going to pick my way up there. Whoa, it's jolly, jolly tough terrain. <laughs> Did I say tough terrain? It's, it's this all the way up. Slippy, rocky, scree. Yeah, quite a slog up there, surprisingly. Just head behind this rock, it's rain from the wind. After sheltering behind the boulder for a couple of minutes, I decided to climb up the b like but looking over to the east, the weather didn't look good and it looked setting for the day. Another very strange landscape we're on now. Look at this. Looks like it goes on for miles. So after finally landing on the plateau and seeing Cranstacky in mist, I decided to push on but realised that the views would probably be zero. Well it started out as fun did this, but it's getting a bit relentless now. You've joined me when I just when I thought it was over. <laughs> so I'm gonna do He's grabbed some lunch now, so down here somewhere, get out the wind, and then carry on this up, skipping over these rocks. Okay, lunch over. It ain't got any better. Finally starting to get um, away from these slabs and uh, boulders and that. So, God, I can just about see the ridge. So right, we're on the western side of uh, Cranstacky Ridge now. That's the 
Point Haven Ridge. I know it's not very clear. Um, sorry, was it can't be helped. That's out to sea, over to the west. So that's the climb up to Cranstecky. So I don't think it's going to improve much more than this. Now I was making good progress onto Cranstacky Summit until then. Back on these again. I should call this mountain Rubble Mountain. Look at it. Just found a shelter. You can't believe how calm it is here. Look at it. It's like a little cave. Not that I'm coming here as well to talk to you. Not that far to the summit now. So. And then out of nowhere, the summit appears. And just as I reached the summit, the rain came, so I decided to get off quick. It started raining like mad up there, I had to get down quick. I've managed to find the path and I've just got into a, well, behind this rock for shelter. God, that was unbelievable, it just came in so quick that uh, heavy rain. Didn't get a chance to get my waterproof on, just thought get down. So right, I'm going to follow this path down now. It's kind of make your own way down this. You know, no path as such. Might, this might just be a sketchy one. So, let's go down there. And after getting battered by the wind and the rain, I managed to find a small path. So I followed it down the beeline and decided to find shelter. Whew, glad to get down there. Wow. If you're coming up to this Corbett, you come up this way. Up this quarry. You join the track over, over there in the distance. Park up on the air road. And then come up here and do the other Corbett, which I'll put on the screen because I can never pronounce it and then you come up this BLAC here onto Cranstacky somewhere where I've just been, somewhere up there so I'm following this ridge and then I'm going to cut east back down to where I came from this morning so yeah not the best of days still enjoyed it Slowly getting down now, down this pea like If you look over there, that's where I went up this morning, right over there. And so I left Cranstacky feeling a tiny little bit disappointed, but not getting any views. But that's mountains, but I will be back to visit it again. Finally leaving the ridge behind now, the pea like See you later, Grand Stack it. Still in Clag. I walked for another 20 minutes and then as I got around the corner, a lot terrible came into view. Nearly back. What an end to a walk. Lock terrible with some blue sky, <laughs> typical in it. To uh, still enjoyed it though. Still a little overcast. Okay, I'll end it here and say thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it. I still enjoyed it. Can't always have sunshine, so I'll leave you with the stunning views of Loch Erebol and say bye for now. Catch you on the next one. again for watching.
see you on the next one.